Is Apple Intelligence now finally coming to Europe? So yes, Apple released Apple Intelligence in the US and other parts of the world in October 2024. It was released alongside iOS 18.1. But unfortunately here in Europe, with regards to the DMA, the Digital Marketing Act, we were left out here in Europe. And actually there were some workarounds to get Apple Intelligence working on your iPhone. I made a video about that, which was received really well but in your day-to-day -day usage it was just annoying to use it like that so it's great now to hear that apple intelligence will be coming to europe as well in ios 18.4 and as apple mentioned themselves it will be released in april 2025 and i'm beyond excited i've been playing around with apple intelligence for months now and there are some amazing features like for example writing tools and this combined with chat GPT that then also will be available is extremely powerful. We will get Genmoji, Image Playground, Notification Summaries, Improved Siri Capabilities. Although I know iOS 18.4 will not come with all the new uh, Siri improved features, but at least some significant differences for the EU. And for example, we'll get Visual Intelligence, which now works with both the camera control and also with the action button as well as with shortcuts. Also the support for different languages in Apple intelligence will be expanded significantly. We'll get for example, Spanish, German, Portuguese, French, Italian, Japanese, Korean, and Chinese, and localized English for Singapore and India. So yeah, we just have to wait a little bit until April, 2025, and then Apple intelligence will be here in Europe. I'm so excited to try this out. And I'm really curious to see how it will work on European devices. Okay, so just as a reminder, which devices will support Apple intelligence here in Europe? So this is the same as in the US. So we have the iPhone 15 Pro, iPhone 15 Pro Max, every single iPhone 16 model has, so we 16, 16 plus, 16 Pro, 16 Pro Max, and a new member of the family, the iPhone 16e. And now if we look at the iPads, every iPad Pro with M1 or newer is gonna get support for Apple intelligence as well as every iPad Air with M1 and the seventh generation iPad with the A17 Pro chip in it. And next, of course, the Mac lineup. We have the MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, iMac, and Mac Mini with M1. They will all get support for Apple Intelligence. The Mac Studio needs to have the M1 Max chip and the Mac Pro needs to have the M2 Ultra in order to support Apple Intelligence. Also, I think it's important to note in general that Apple intelligence is not fully there yet. It's a gradual process. It will take time to have the full Apple intelligence experience. So I'm talking here now in general, this applies to both the US and other parts of the world, as well as the EU. There are still some amazing new features that we won't have in iOS 18.4 in April. Likely iOS 18.5 or iOS 18.6, if we will get that, will feature almost everything that got announced at WWE. WDC in 2024. Think for example here about like a Siri screen awareness, like the whole Siri experience or the Apple intelligence experience overall through every single component of your iPhone or the ecosystem. This is a massive, massive task for Apple to do this well, and it will take some time to get this done properly. And just as a last reminder, it will be introduced in iOS 18.4, iPadOS 18.4 and macOS sequoia 15.4 all right guys i hope this was helpful make sure to subscribe hit the bell icon like this video and see you in the next one stay tuned for more peace